I just go with the flow of the painting. So I just start off with any old mark, go where it leads me to. Literally the paintbrush picking up whichever one I pick up can lead it in a different direction. It actually originally came from the very core of what did you do when you were a kid? I drew. Did you love it? Yes, I did. What else did you do? Horse riding, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> I want the paintings to have energy, but I do find them meditative too when I'm creating them. I'm always thinking about other things. I often have a podcast going on at the same time. It's good for my mental health, my balance, to be in the quiet studio, listen to things, and just express everything that comes out on the canvas. I love being outside. I'm not a sports person, but I'm very much an outdoors sunshine go for a walk by the beach kind of person. And to me, that's very much my happy place. It's where I get my energy. And here I live beside the river and I get to see the river every day and the light that reflects off it through the trees. And to me, it's just magical. And I like the depth of the navy blue with the softer parts around it because uh, the sea, pools, the river, everything has layers and layers of light through it, which change the color depending on how you look at it and for me the gold is very much about the sun just the sun reflecting off bouncing off the water to run a successful art business i think you have to have a certain amount of structure be able to say no sometimes create boundaries create timetables my brain is very practical in many ways and it just has this creative bit that has just always been yeah, nudging me along from day one, so <laughs> that has to be indulged as well. He is kind of supporting me in my artwork, doing my framing, helping me out. And as a builder as well, he's also practical and creative. He's a left-handed person there, so he's a little bit strange. <laughs> it's the moment of time, so if I come back to it in three months' time, I'm in a whole different mindset. It's gonna be a very different painting if I start messing with it. Um, so now I try and create them, finish them, step away from them and be proud of what I've done. You know, it'll turn into something and someone will connect with it. And if they don't, they don't, that's fine. For me, I needed to do this. I needed to create this. This is what my hand was telling me. This is what my brain was telling me. This is what has come out of me. I can pick up a pen or a paint brush and I can just be swallowed up by it for hours and hours and that's what makes me happy and it always has so that's what I'm doing. <laughs>